Hello and welcome to the Young Architects Challenge. We're going to design a pavilion today. And as you know, pavilions can be anything. They can look like anything, they can be used for different purposes. And this is the real inspiring thing for architects. It's their way to express their creativity, express their ideas in an almost sculptural piece of architecture. So today I'm going to show you how to build a model of a simple pavilion. So I like to start with a simple sketch. Normally, I would take a big piece of paper to allow my freedom and I would divide it into four parts. Now this allows me to understand what my design, what my pavilion looks like from different points of view. You usually start with the front view and then try and transform the view to the side. So what would that same design, that same piece of architecture look like looking at it from sideways? And then a bird's eye view, always very useful to imagine it on a map, on a satellite view to see what it looks like. The 3D view is really to connect the other views together and understand the whole look of the building. And it's also useful when I start making a model. So for a model, we're using simple materials that you can find in any art shop or just buy online, such as card, brown card, white card, colored paper, cellophane, modeling clay or plasticine, scissors, wood sticks, string, or anything similar to that. And I'll start off with this base, which is A6 size, so it's about 10 by 15 centimeters big, and it will constrain me, and constraints are really good in design, it will constrain the size of my model so that I don't make it too big or too small. So for this pavilion, for example, I was inspired by a bird's nest that I saw last weekend, which for me had this sense of something close, something protective, but also something approachable and something inviting. And that's what my model looks like. So once you're finished with your design and made a nice model of it, we need you to take a good photo of it with good lighting and good focus, and then just upload it to our website. 